Hey guys, it's Stephanie, and I know I have been away for a while, and you guys might think this is normal of me, because you're like, eh, you go away for a while, and then you come back. But lately, I have just not been able to get back on my YouTube train, because there's just been a lot going on in my life, and I know I always say that, like, there's always so much going in my life, but you want me to lie and be like, I'm just lazy, and I don't like to upload videos. Uh, I just wanted to catch up with you guys and let you guys know what's been going on in my life. And yes, this is going to be a rant. So if y'all don't like rants, then it's okay. You can leave. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't like rants too. Sometimes I click out. As for the rest of you that are going to stay here. Sweet. You can just hear me talk. Not sure if you're going to like it, but I need to get real for a second. Oh, also, I'm probably going to like be finishing up my makeup because um, I need to get to work in like an hour. So, real quick, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm not complaining, I'm not whining, I'm not making excuses. I have been feeling this for a while, and this was the best way that I could get it out of my system. So, let's continue the video. Let's get it popping. One of the main reasons that I have been away from YouTube and not uploading is because I have just not been healthy and guys are like okay so like how have you not been healthy well here's the thing um i have had health teachers in the past but this one is especially making an impact on me and she's she's showing us so many things that you can put in your body that are just not good for you at all and because of this i have been afraid to put so many different things in my body even my mom's cooking like i've been afraid to eat that because i don't know what i'm doing to myself and I'm just so scared that I might do something to screw up my body and my mind I guess thinks that okay maybe if I put stuff that I know is good for me in my body then it'll be good enough but the thing about me is that I don't know that much about health or cooking because I grew up in very very different situations that my sisters did like my sisters had to cook like they had to take turns my age I have been eating very like sometimes I only eat two one to two times a day and I know that's so bad I I skip breakfast I come home I eat later if I get hungry I eat but it's always the same thing and I know that it's not good for you but I'm just so afraid to put something in my body that's going to do more damage than good and I know maybe what I'm doing right now is putting damage to my body and it would be easier for me to just put unhealthy things in my body well for me in my brain <laughs> This is healthier. I know it's bad. I have been feeling really, really unhealthy and sick and tired. And my grades have been going down. Like most times when I'm in school, I just want to get the F out of there because I'm just so done. Sometimes I would just come home and fall asleep, wake up, eat, and then fall asleep again. And then it would be the next day. Like I had had days like that. I've just been letting go of myself healthily so easy. And because of this, my mental state right now is not good at all. And I really truly believe that is that sometimes the most dangerous place to be is alone with your thoughts. I have just about always been alone with my thoughts. I am the youngest and my siblings have all moved out and made their own life because you always look for advice but maybe they're a little busy they answer late i'm not saying that they never give me advice like they are always there for me and they're so supportive and it's hard because you know that you can't always have that there you don't have that safety net it's only sometimes there ask me why don't you just go to your friends it's hard for me to uh, completely utterly let my emotions out in front of other people that aren't my family. I give them a little piece or like a little nibble of my life, but I do not like to tell them everything that's been going on. It's just hard. Sometimes I don't understand other people's problems and I feel bad because I do not know how to help them. The best thing I can do is just give them advice and tell them that it's going to be okay. I mean, I'm only a teenager. I don't know. I haven't gone through a lot of things that, the, that other people have gone through in their lives, so it's hard to relate to them. You know, that's why I'm just trying to get through. And because I do have some friends, they love being active. So in order to try to get myself to be more active, I decide to go hang out with them more because they're people that make me feel happy and that we don't always get into deep, deep talks. And the thing about getting into deep 
talks with my friends is that we may be talking about something positive, but in my mind, I don't know why this happens. Maybe it's because I'm not taking care of myself, but my mind likes to turn it into a bad thing. So the rest of my day is just thinking and thinking and thinking about this, wondering what's going to happen, and it's it's terrifying. And that's why I have been trying to avoid these talks. That's why I have been trying not to talk too much into my life. So instead, I find other ways to keep myself occupied. I go play volleyball or I even try to film videos. But the thing about being in this state and filming videos is that I film them. But I just do not, like, I don't seem like myself. But today... I'm going to decide to get another mindset, to try to not look at the negatives, but lately it's just been a lot harder. Maybe it's supposed to be harder, it's not supposed to be easy. And I feel that maybe if I stop thinking that it's hard and just find one positive thing, like, like the sky is really pretty today. Hey, there's one positive thing that I can live on today. Yeah, that's what's been going on in my life. So that's why I haven't been uploading as much as I want to. I look like a little football player. Just like, okay. Anyways, I have noticed that my channel is growing. Okay, I'm not dumb. I do look at things and honestly, I'm so excited. Oh, by the way, if like you, you just barely subscribed and this is one of the first videos you're watching. um, Yeah, I'm not always like this. Okay, so like, so like, you know. This isn't really me. Okay, I think I put too much of this on. Can we just... As I was saying, if you guys are new to my channel, I'm not always like this, I promise. I'm, I'm not some crazy person that likes to complain, okay? I'm better. Today was just enough day. And I felt like I needed to let you guys know because I feel like it's so unfair that you guys are constantly like waiting and waiting and waiting and I rarely post anything. So that is why I decided to just go for it and let you guys know and have a bit more insight on what's been going on. Um, anyway, now that that kind of deep, intense talk is over, so now let me tell you about this whole YouTube thing. I just dropped a brush, I'll be back. Yeah. Got it, okay. Here's the thing, remember that CCH um, series that I was gonna start, the Cute, Cheap, and Homemade series? Well, that didn't go too well. well the thing about that series is that I feel like there is something that does not want me to succeed. I have had two epic fails lately. Like, I remember one, I was going to do macaroons for Valentine's Day. Well, hey, those macaroons came out like crap. They were nasty, okay? And then I'm like, okay, fine. I'll just do um, cake mix cookies. <sighs> Honey, that came out even worse. I went to go get the freaking cake mix. And there was maggots in it, okay? And I had just come back from the store to get eggs for this project. And I just wasted a whole egg on a dough that had freaking maggots. Because I feel like I'm always worrying too much about the kind of video that I'm going to upload. And I feel like I just need to stop. Like, I need a breather and just chill. I have filming schedules now, so hey. And I know that not everybody is about these videos and about these rants, so don't worry. This is probably gonna be like a once in a lifetime thing that I do. I guess that's it for today and yeah. Bye guys.